All right, there he is. That's that's our subject, the guy with the creepy mustache and the coveralls. Oh, coveralls or overalls? Overalls. Overalls. What's the difference? Aren't coveralls like full body? Mhm. Mm okay. There he is. Put a tail on him. You want me to take him out for you? You want me to take him out for you? Yeah, go ahead. Okay. Didn't work. You're gonna have to get a clear shot. Wait, did he stop because of the bomb? He might have. Or he knows I'm here. No, no, he couldn't possibly know. You blew my cover. Ah! I blew your cover. Come on. Come on, man. Go. Go. Move back. Fall back, fall back. There he is. Okay, okay. It was because you were too close. Okay, I'm going around. Well, no, 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 no. Don't go around. I can't. That's stupid. Go follow him. Fine. What? Oops. What? You need a good camera angle. Now he's just going to despawn or something. No, he's not. It doesn't work that way. If he despawns... It doesn't work that way. It does. He's gone. No, no. He's okay, right okay, there. He's still there. By the way, hey guys and gals, I'm Pal. And this, I'm Nova. And she's in control of this episode, tailing what's his face. No, go Stupid, away. Stupid, creepy man. And we are taking a picture of this man. A picture of this man. Where is he? Where is he? He's behind us. Okay. So our goal is to take a picture of this man for Lenzo. Very, very stereotypical. Not stereotypical name. Very obvious reference there. We're going to be taking a picture of this dude get, uh, mailing his unrequited love letter. It's pronounced unrequited. Uh, I've heard it both ways. Can you check? Where is he? He's slow. Look, He's right behind Go look us. at him. Because he... He may not... Okay, he's right there. I told you. I was thinking he might not move if we're not looking at him, because other games can do stuff like that. Pikmin is one of them. You remember that? Mm-hmm. So I thought that maybe this game was doing that too. That'd be dumb if this game did it. It's dumb that Pikmin does it too, but... No, 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 no. Right? No! What? What? No! Go away! Go away, you evil man! No, no, take the picture, take the picture! I'm trying. Ta there. Save it, save it, save it, save it, save it! That's fine. Okay. Wow, he sure snuck up on us. <sighs> what, what on earth was that? That was the game, or rather, that was the old man clearly Sabotaging being creepy. Us. That guy's creepy. There are names for him, but I'm not going to say them on this channel. He's just a creepy man. He looks like a zombie, too. He's a vagabond. So, I think we do... Ho hopefully, ho he better like this one. Hmm, that's not quite right. I'm terribly... Mm. I blame the hobo. St ah! Hobos ruin everything! It was not close up. That was proper headroom. And lead room. Do it, do it. No way for it. Now. Okay, I think you're good. I think you're good. Okay, take two. Hopefully the boss likes these pho picto pictographs. I want to say photograph, but they're pictographs. Okay, try the try the worst one first. Does that one work? No. Okay. Next one. This one better work. No. <sighs> if the next one doesn't work... I will eat you. I will eat you. What? 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 That is utter garbage. It wasn't too close. <sighs> Seriously, why are we being graded on photography within a game? Yeah. As long as the guy is in the picture, it should count. <laughs> it should totally count. Now. Yeah. No, you should have saved it. Okay, that's it. Third, four, fourth time's the charm. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we have some hard-hitting journalism here today. We have the pictograph. Show it. Oh, -ho. Oh -ho! now this is a finely snapped pictograph indeed. They say love is blind, but what could be... Th 
What could he be thinking, mailing all those letters? I should not ridicule him, for he reminds me of myself back in the innocence of my youth. Memories of those bittersweet summer days come rushing back at me. But I digress. Very good, young sir. I must congratulate you on passing your first test. I shall promptly take this pictograph from you and use it most efficiently. Next challenge. Very well. Next is my second command. You must search this town's most timid and cowardly resident. I tend to flog his spirit so as to lend him some backbone. This individual flinches and jumps at even the slightest of surprises. I need you to capture the instant of pure fear on this individual's face in a pictograph. So tell me, do you think you can compete with this task, good sir? I know exactly who he's talking about. Same here, because I read the book. We're using the Prima Guide, by the way. Did I not make that clear? Gee, Mr. Fairy! Miss Tangle already? Uh, good old Tinkle. Tinkle's the best team. The team that no one ever believed in. Alright, okay, now first. what we're supposed to be doing is getting a shot of this guy, because if we break something in his presence, he will get freaked out. Don't break anything yet. Don't break anything yet. I want to I wanna see how long I have to take the picture. This is the book, this is the shot that you want. Okay. I believe you can break a stool, and it works better. Okay. So that's a good amount of time I have right Or, there. no, no, break the pot. So you have two chances here, and then you leave and come back. So, from there... Uh, you should probably set it down. Set it down and get your shot first. Where are you going to shoot it from? Get his face, because he, he wants the face in this shot. It's so, like behind the, the median. Yeah, 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 try that. I think that's good. So go ahead and throw a pot there, and then you got it. I, I believe in you. Ready, set, go! Now! Okay, try it again, try it again. You, you have some chances here, so. Try not, try to get more of his body. Yeah. Nice. Again, no, you no, missed I'm it. No, I'm trying that. You think that's good? No, but I'm going to try it. Okay. I think, I think we got it. Also, <laughs> I would expect more of a reaction if someone threw a pot right at my face. <laughs> I mean, I would get probably kind of angry. Of course, I would be angry after I was done bleeding. Alright. Now for a return to hard-hitting journalism! <laughs> uh, wow, really? Okay, standards are <laughs> low on this I one. I am an expert. Clearly, this individual must be the town's most timid of denizens. Fear is his constant companion. I cannot complain, young sir. You have passed in a most admirable manner. Say, is, and is it me, or is this chap quite the striking individual? What? Very good, young sir. And this means you have passed my second test. I shall promptly take this pictograph from you and use it most efficiently. I'm beginning to question his motives. Yeah, me too. This is getting But this weird. is a gutter speak free channel, so Yeah. <laughs> uh I mean to be fair, he's he openly admitted that his hobby is sneaking up on people and capturing them in their most uh vulnerable moments, I believe he says. But still consider what the subject has been yeah. in the last two yeah. pictographs. Yeah. And he said he would use them in an efficient way. Yeah. Um It's let's, getting creepy. Let's just uh, pass this guy up. Somewhere in this town is a couple, a man and a woman whose hearts are secretly filled with the thoughts of the other. And yet for reasons unknown, the two have never spoken. Even when they happen by chance to pass by each other on the road, they each st steal a brief, furtive glance at the other, but they suppress the longing in their hearts. I cannot let this tragedy go on any longer. For the sake of the town and my own desire to help these poor souls, I shall become Cupid, Archer of Love. These two are timid burglars in the House of Love, and you must capture a pictograph of them thinking their furtive thoughts. On, oh, young Master Link, if and when, be hope beyond hope, you manage to complete this third task, then you shall become my younger... younger... 
My younger one pupil. <laughs> Does that not excite you? Good luck to you, good sir. What voice is that anyway? Does it have a name? Uh, it does, but you you're going you guys are gonna have to guess. I mean, one name could be Mr. Howl from Giggle Giggle Giggleins, <laughs> Giggleins Island, <laughs> but no, that's not what I'm going for here. All right, so where is Anton? The woman, the woman is to the behind you. She's to the behind you. Oh. That's the dude. That's the dude. This is gonna take a while. So we are supposed to follow him through town. And when he reaches the lighthouse building, he stops and looks into Linda's eyes. Take a pictograph in the split second when their eyes meet, making sure to get both of them in the shot. Return to Lenzo. Oh my goodness. Go and shoot away. this man in his face! <sighs> this guy's so annoying! <sighs> I think this is Tingle's dad, even though we've already seen him. Okay, follow the man. Follow him. He's coming toward me. Fire emblem. Oh, no, no, no. How do you get fire emblem out of the Shh, let me concentrate. Frame perfect. Right there, man. Okay, I'm done. And now for our fourth part of hard hitting journalism. Oh, <laughs> this is a finely snapped pictograph indeed. I have no idea these two would get along so s splendidly. You can see the love there, hidden but thriving. Even I, who have lived in this town for so many long years, did not realize the slightest extent of their passion. You have done well, Link. I shall promptly take this pictograph from you and use it most efficiently. Now then, my young sir, you have completed all the tasks I have set for you. My doubts about you have all been cleared up. I shall now hereby pr be proud to call you my assistant, Link. And to reward you further for your line of efforts, I offer you this. The elderly lady next door tells me of its it, it has value of sorts. He just called the teacher elderly. She's not that elderly. No. You got a joy pendant. You can put it in your spoils bag. From here onward, ra come rain or wind, my heart shall rest in comfortable ease. And at the same time, your heart will learn the love that pictography fosters. Oh, oh no, 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 no. Okay, no, no, talk to him. Talk to him. From here onward, come rain. Okay. <laughs> you just want to do the voice some more. No, there's something else we can say. Ex exam. No, 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 no. Show him the picture box. Because we have to get the deluxe. Please, sir. May I have some Whom more? now? Are you offering me this thing? Sadly, I have no need of it. Okay, leave and come back. No, don't do that. You would set it free, and we would die. And now for our fourth part of hard-hitting journalism. <laughs> This voice is really fun. Ooh. My assistant, Link, allow me a brief query. Do you perchance know about pictographs with color? I have researched this concept for many years, and at long last I understand it. A stronger light is needed to imbue color into the pictograph. No normal light will do. In fact, normal light must be overcome. Color pictography requires a light of the very brightest intensity. Now I have heard tales of a mystical creature in the place called Forest Haven. It is said to be the tiniest of creatures, one who unleashes an otherworldly light. As an aid to me in my research, could you possibly use an empty bottle to capture one of these creatures of legend? All I need is a mustache to complete this look. Okay. Ready? Yeah. 
Oh, by the way, we got this last episode. <laughs> what? <laughs> we got the. <laughs> wait, wait, don't skip it. We got this uh, last episode before it even began off screen, and I'm showing it now, so it's not off screen. Is is that? Also, with the, with the jaw contortions I have to do with this voice, like I have to make sure my mic doesn't fall off every two sentences. Why I fear the secret light has been extinguished forever. Is that truly one of the long favored forest fireflies? Oh glory! My vine is distant link. For ages it has been said that the that the forest fireflies possess a mis mythical power. For your efforts, I shall place this one inside your box. Come on now, hand me your pedo box, if only for a moment. And with that, I'll stab you in the stomach. <laughs> you got a deluxe pedo box. It has been imbued with the mystical light, so it can now take color photographs. Set it to and skip. Oh, uh -huh. now those pictographs of yours have been forever lacking in that scintillating palette of life shall henceforth show the world as it is meant to be. In live- wow. In living color. Thanks for the reference. Hmm, now, that was quite an easy thing to do after all. Ah, oh, well, such is life. Now go out there and snap pictographs. Snap them in color for me, for all the years I spent unable to do so. Go to it, Link! All right, now Finally, that we've done this, we can stop listening to you do that voice. No, because there's one more instance of hard-hitting journalism that we have to accomplish. Okay, go, go, left, right, 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 take a left, 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 left. Intelligible directions, please. Take a full-body photo. Sounds creepy. Of the woman in the orange dress. The book said that, not me. Okay. Hello, would you mind if we took this photograph of your face? Okay, now go to the Manny man. Where's Manny? Anton starts We're out We're calling here. him Manny now. Oh, wait, no, no, that's, that's a name going to be saved for another character later. Okay, if we show the picture to this guy. Oh, big, oh wait, I'm sorry. <laughs> Please the, stop. The, 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 this girl. Actually, buddy, this is the girl I've had my eye on lately. <laughs> What? Wow, she really is that pretty. I mean, just seeing this picture that reminds me of how good this girl is. You can hardly tell what you're saying. <laughs> but no, I'll never be happy to be a mere picture, never. No, say I made my decision, I'm going to either go around with me. It has to be done, buddy. <laughs> what? <laughs> On earth. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I've got a little time to find me at the family bar for coffee, but... <laughs> Oh, what's her name? What's her name anyway? They live on the same dinky island. How can he not know her name? <laughs> she, he's so nervous. <laughs> That's just fun to say. He's so nervous. Okay, switch the day into night, please. Switch the day into night, please. Okay. Ah, uh, my face tingles from that voice. Uh, quite often in these episodes, my face will tingle. I don't know why. It's from lack of oxygen. I think so. Uh, it means you need to stop and breathe every now and then. <laughs> it means I have to return to hard-hitting journalism. They, I hope not. Ah! Hey. I've had something on my mind ever since the pictographer who lives on the red brick building told me my fortune. He told me that if I send a beautiful pictograph of myself to the one who has captured my heart, true love will blossom in return. So I, should, I couldn't help but notice that you have a picto box of your own, don't you? Do you think you could take a pictograph of me to, and send it to the apple of my eye? Maybe he'll notice my affections. You leave it to me! Really? How splendid! Be sure to get my good side. Oh, I want to show off this outfit, so don't just take a pictograph of my face. Can you be sure to get my whole body in the pictograph? Okay, do it again, just to make sure. Welcome back to hard-hitting journalism! Today we have unrequited love, now requited, with the man and the woman. 
Let's talk to them and interview them to see what they say. Hey, it's you. Listen to this, will you? I did it. I worked up my courage and talked to her. And she was totally the right move. You know why, buddy? She likes me. She actually likes me. <laughs> this voice is amazing. Uh, the two of us are going to start... Oh, wait. <laughs> what? <laughs> she what? The two of us are going to start dating. Don't we make a delightful couple? I'm so happy. That's why we want to share some of our happiness with you. His face is like, yeah, whatever she says. Finally! You got a piece of heart. <laughs> His voice we is just, amazing. We just got the fourth piece. Take good care of it. Okay, there's one more thing I'd like to do in this video. <laughs> and and that is make a return on No, okay, I'm gonna stop. Uh, now that I've, I'm done hyperventilating, I'm gonna hyperventilate again. Alright, we're going to go be going to different islands since Sofa wants to strangle me right now and get heart pieces that we have treasure charts for. Since we have the ability to warp, we can now do this, and I believe that we can actually get straight up a heart container right now. So, go, Nova, go, Nova, go! Oh, it's right, 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 there, 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 there! Right there. I think. I, I hope I'm right. Yeah! First time, that's awesome. All right. I was gonna stop anyway. If in, you said anything or not. In E7, Angular Isles. They're isles that look like a bunch of crates or boxes. There is a thing from treasure chart number 14, and it contains the first piece of heart that we are after. Get okay, next. In E2, which is Pauprint Isle, which we visited earlier this adventure, uh, from treasure chart number 30. Once again, on, on the uh, scrolls, I should be saying how you get these treasure charts. It's not just, you're, you're supposed to get it for 30. Uh, we will be getting a piece of heart. No, it's a pizza heart. Pizza heart, yeah. You know, whenever you say that, I have to put it on screen, right? Put it on screen how? I, I CG it over the heart. CG! E1, or Crescent Moon Isle. Is it Crescent Moon Isle or just Crescent? Crescent? I'm not sure. It's Crescent Moon Island. Uh, from treasure chart 11 is the other thing. Do I really need to specify that it's a piece of heart? All these that we're getting are pieces of heart. Pizza heart. No. Piece of heart because otherwise it makes my editing life harder. As if this episode isn't going to be a nightmare to edit already. Okay. Bring out your map. We have like a two more, I think. Dang, cool. What? Whoa. What? Bombs. Wait? What? Wow. Okay. Neat. Okay, this is... I don't even know what this one gives. This is going to be a surprise. But in A5, which is... Or sorry, A6, which is where we need to go for a heart piece, uh, there's apparently a big octo. Okay. This one might give a piece of heart. I have no clue. This was not planned. Right between the eyes, which is not where you need to shoot. Got it. Bombs, I think, work a lot better. Nice, and dead. Nice. Yeah, I think bombs work better than the boomerang. Would you agree? Yeah, but I think the boomerang is more fun. You see, the thing about this is that I have much more knowledge of manly football, man. I'm in my man cave with my man pewter, with ma making man cheats and manculations to figure out all the footballs. best video. You know what another good video is? What? This one. You know why? Why? <laughs> because it answers the top questions of hard-hitting journalism. <laughs> it's such a good... Okay, you, you guys out there, because I know some of my viewers make their own videos, you know when you come across a gem of a voice that you didn't know you could do, you spam it all day. Lame. Okay, that's that's not bad. All right, now on to onward to the actual thing. All right, in A6 or Diamond Steppy Island, Step. we have a hard piece, and this is from Treasure Chart. Um, 
Um. Um. I can't find it. But it's on screen right now. New Harpit container. That's our first row, right? I don't know. I think that's our first row. And finally, in square A4, 3i Reef, there is one from treasure chart number... Da -ba -da -ba. Number 38. Once again, I don't know where we got these, but we obviously did get these. Um, so on screen, it will explain where to get these. Who got a pizza heart? <sighs> and how many hearts do we have? We have 10 hearts, right? Right? Mm -hmm. We just completed our first row! And now we are done. You need to get out of there. Get out of there. That aim, though. All right. Thank you so much for watching, and if you enjoyed this episode in any, any capacity, please click like. And if you didn't, then drop a comment telling me how I can make the next episode so that you would like it. We release new episodes of Wind Wakers Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Saturdays. Saturdays are not long episodes, as an old habit. And we'll see you guys next time, where I'm not sure what we're going to do. We might get a few more pizza, pizza hearts. Now you have me saying it. <laughs> we might get a few more uh, heart pieces. We might do some other stuff. But it's going to be action-y. There's going to be very action. So action. Much fun. See you guys next time.